from Global Strategy and Real Estate Philippines. GSL Nostra Paredes. And earlier this week, we were at Bonifacio Global City visiting the top luxury car brands in the Philippines to get insider information for you. Check out this video. So we're here at Jaguar, Land Rover, and Mercedes-Benz Philippines. We're about to go inside the showrooms. Come with us. Let's go. Hello, and we're with Sir Jake of Mercedes-Benz Philippines. We'll be answering some questions you might have about purchasing your first Mercedes in the Philippines. Sir Jake, um, we just want to know what is the usual price range for Mercedes-Benz units in the Philippines? Uh, our price starts at 2.7 mm -hmm. million, uh, 9.5 9, 9 million. Mm -hmm. And what's the best selling unit you have? Uh, actually, all of our cars are really moving, but mm -hmm. uh, most of the bulk of sales come came from the E-Class and the C-Class. Mm -hmm. yeah. And these units are manufactured where? Uh, all of our units are manufactured in Germany. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Germany, uh, some units came from the US, like mm -hmm. the SUVs. And the C-Class is made, it's came from Malaysia. What's the buying process like in the Philippines? How long does it take? Buying process, if the client made the reservation already, he can wait three days mm -hmm. to prepare. So we'll prepare the unit, the documents, and the quality check of the units. How long did you really take? Sorry. I've been here for almost two years. Do you know, um, how much the tax is allocated? The tax? Mm -hmm. uh, I believe the tax is around 10%. Right. Okay. Yeah. Um, also, do you accept custom requests? Customizations for the cars? Yes. But how that will long? take mm -hmm. probably a year. Mm -hmm. Due to the pandemic, it will probably right. take more time. Be before the pandemic, how long? Seven months. Seven Six, months. seven months, mm -hmm. eight months. That's, that's, I think that's reasonable. Yes. What about maintenance and repairs? Do you have accredited service centers in the Philippines? Our service center is only at Cats Motors, mm -hmm. which is uh, in Green Hills and in Pasig. What about insurance? Does it come with insurance or do you have a uh, we have uh, um, We have a partner mm -hmm. when it comes to the insurance of vehicles. It's Paramount Insurance. Mm -hmm. uh, that's, uh, the, the client has the option to get the part the insurance from us. Mm -hmm. yeah. okay. Um and I guess last question to Jake is we have text for foreign clients that may want to buy units in the Philippines. What is the bro uh, process like for them? Is there an additional requirement that they have to No. Mm -hmm. As long as they have the cash to buy it, there's no questions asked. That's it. Thank you so much, Sir Jake. Yes. Thank you for accommodating us today. Yes. May back to you, moderators. What is it that the moderators see this thing? Right, I sunset in Hakuma. And what is that? That is us. So G L E, some get to G. Oh, automatic. No more than this. Tra Mercedes Benz no. It's CV model. Toto naka. Ito yung masyo. Eh, ito mo pwede ko kakuy na. Ito ito mo bonin na rin desu na. Ito ito ne da mo ito ito kite me mas na. from Jaguar and Land Rover Philippines and he'll be accommodating a few questions that you might have regarding purchasing your first luxury car in the Philippines. So first, Sir Rafi, what is the usual price range for um, Land Rover or Jaguar cars in the Philippines? Uh, the usual average for prices for mm -hmm. Jaguar and Land Rover is going to be 
be around uh, 67 million. But for the mm. overall range of year selling units, there are 5 million all the way up to 15 million pesos. Um, currently, what's the best selling unit? Currently, the best selling unit that we have is the, la the new Land Rover Defender, the 2020 new Land Rover Defender. Uh, that's our current best seller as it is completely an all new product. Also, do you want to ask your stocks in the Philippines? Where is it manufactured? Uh, all of our units are manufactured in the UK. Mm -hmm. So, all, we get all of our units from there. Sir, in the Philippines, what is the buying process like? And how long does it usually take? Uh, the buying process is fairly easy for in the Philippines uh, for a driver and uh, Just first have to determine if the customer is uh, cash basis or financing basis. Mm -hmm. So for the cash basis, it's a lot faster. For the financing basis, it's going to usually take up to a week uh, for approval with the banks. But once we have everything, we can release the car uh, pretty quickly from three, from three to five days. Mm -hmm. Can you share with us? Do you have an idea how much the taxes are? Uh, for the taxes, uh, I'm not really mm -hmm. sure. I don't okay. know. Only it's the upper it's management only, uh, is familiar with mm -hmm. that. Great, it's really fine. Thank you. Um, do you accept custom requests? Customizations for the Oh, yeah. Requests? For customizations, uh, we do in that order. Uh, for some customers that want to personalize their driver, land with your car, in terms of exterior color, interior color, mm -hmm. and features that they want to have inside the unit. They can fully so, yeah. personalize your car. Mm -hmm. uh, it's for pre order. Yeah, for pre order and then in an order basis. Uh, usually it's going to take around five to six months mm -hmm. uh, upon, receive, uh, upon receiving the payment of the plan. Mm -hmm. What about your maintenance uh, and repairs? We have an accredited CASA in the Philippines. Is there one specific for uh, Jaguar or Land Rover? Uh, there's only one uh, accredited. Mm -hmm. uh, Servicing for mm -hmm. Jaguar Land Rover units, and that's our dealership in Green Hills. Mm -hmm. So that's where we only service our Jaguar Land Rover units. Uh, also, want to add when, we, when customers purchase from us, they get a free five, five year service plan. Mm -hmm. So they get free servicing for five years. Lastly, um, do you have decks for foreign investors or foreigners that want to buy cars in the Philippines? Specifically for Jaguar and Land Rover, and what's the buy process? Do they need to pass other requirements? Is there special documents that they need to present? Uh, in terms of tips for uh, foreign investment investors uh, buying their first luxury car, uh, I can't really give out any tips. Just really visit our showroom, do your research on the websites, uh, figure out your price rate, price mm -hmm. range, and your budget. Visit us in our showroom so you can actually see the unit and you can also test drive the unit as well. And then, in terms of requirements that you have to submit, mm -hmm. you, need, uh, you have to actually do, do you have one, one requirement, a uh, valid ID, that's right. all. Mm -hmm. Valid ID and, uh, and some the cash or bank financing features, or that's it, and you can already buy your card. So, I guess that's it for our questions for Sir Rafi. Thank you so much for accommodating us this morning. We're here at PGA Car Philippines handling Porsche, Lamborghini, and Bentley, and Audi in the Philippines. We'll try to get an interview. Do my show. So, PGA Turbo is the model of the day. Go sing my end. で、well, unfortunately, because of privacy issues, we're not allowed to shoot inside the store, but we'll have a rundown for you in a little bit. For Ferrari Philippines, the usual price range goes for 8 to 30 million pesos. For Maserati, that's 4 million to 30 million pesos. Maserati, 
for all the Philippines, that's 3.5 to 9 million pesos. Aldiwa, nana sing, nana ha kumang, si mase, nana ha kumang kara, sing hapya kumang made. Lamborghini is around 8 to 24 million Philippine pesos. Lamborghini wa, sing rupya kumang kara, yung sing hapya kumang this. And Porsche is 6.25 to 23 million pesos. Porsche wa, sing ni ha kugoju mang kara. Yung sing rupya kuman in this. For additional information on car purchasing in the Philippines, check out the rest of the video. Buyers are able to buy these cars in the Philippines with no problem if paying with cash. But if you're looking towards bank financing, which usually has a little bit more requirements, please feel free to reach out to GSR or Philippine Asset Consulting via these links. Or follow us in all our social media accounts. SNS mo, photo stick the sign. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click on the bell button to get notified whenever we upload new videos. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. Matane. Matane.